As you probably have seen that I'm back from Australia and I Instagram a photo of all the goodies that I brought back. So I thought why not do an Aussie snack haul. The first thing I'm going to show you is the natural confectionery coat. My favorite one is the snakes and it's the pink one. I don't know what flavor this is. I think it's probably strawberry. This is actually really popular in Australia because it's marketed as to be 99% fat free. It has no artificial colors or flavors. Like they're, they're quite stretchy look. Oh. They're not too chewy and they're not hard. They're not sour, they're just a normal like fruity flavor. So I'm assuming the orange is orange. And then you have the purple, which is like grape, I think. And then you have yellow, which is probably lemon. This is the Allen's Chicos. With this one, I actually was introduced this by my best friend, Julie. It's a chocolate baby. They actually have perfect faces on them. Oh my God. It has like a creamy, chocolatey, coffee kind of taste. So these are the famous, famous minties. And I don't know if you guys know, but we had um, this really famous minty challenge where we actually, um, ha who, it's like whoever can rip um, the minty, minty wrapper and get the longest like length. Basically, you have to rip as thin as you can. Um, as you can see, this is the longest I can get. Have you guys seen these scissors? Oh my God, this brings so much, brings back so much memory. I'm gonna eat the purple one, of course, and this one is a great flavor. Now, why are they called fizzes? Is because when you actually eat, eat, bite them, they fizz in your mouth. That. Let me try a new flavor like this one, cherry. It's not the actual one that actually um, like sparkle and like pop in your mouth. It's actually a really subtle fizz. Let's get these ones, and these are called the Zappo. Oh, I think Aussies come up with really weird, weird names like fizzes and zappos. These ones come in multi colors, and I swear to God, we do not have these flavors back in school. We had these ones, which were the grape flavors. They kind of like the fizzes, but they don't fizz. And they're more chewier. Now they have like new flavors like the Coca Cola, they have Tutti Frutti, and pineapple. The famous Cabri. Cadbury is actually a chocolate factory that we have, I think it's in Tasmania. And they make a large range of chocolate bars and things like that. But I picked this one up because it's actually new and I always to try things new. And this is actually the Marshmallow Bites, which are mint flavor. I think it comes in other flavors too. I already know that chocolate tastes nice because Cadbury chocolates are the best. But the inside is like a minty flavored marshmallow. I can see these become really addictive. Last but not least, the infamous Tim Tams. I actually went through the customs um, back in LA and they, the, the, the custom lady was like, did you have any spare Tim Tams for her? I'm like, I'm sorry, I don't even have enough myself. I personally still obsessed with the original, which is the milk chocolate. Um, however, the dark chocolate is quite nice as well for um, because it does contain more flavonoids, as we know. It's just a normal square looking biscuit, chocolate covered biscuit, but oh my God. And basically two pieces of chocolate biscuit with a filling inside and then cover the whole thing in chocolate again. I actually would finish the whole packet not realizing. Uh-huh. Exactly. I just want to compare, I'll show you the difference. It's not much difference really. It's just, you know, one's dark chocolate, one's milk chocolate. It comes speechless after eating this. Oh my god, it's so good. That was pretty much the majority of the Australian snacks that I usually have some sort of connection with, either it's from a memory from a back to primary school or whether it's, you know, things that I still eat today. So as I have been away, I have been trying to get back to all your comments and I read them, they're so lovely and I want to thank you guys and I want to know whether, what is your favorite snack and if you can tweet me a photo of you and your favorite snack and tell me why you like it, I'll somehow try to get my hands on it and try it as well because I love snacks obviously and I will see my next video. Thanks for watching, bye.